What is going on, Zombie Mob? It is Ahmed, and I am back today with yet another video for you all. And today, guys, we're going to talk about Zombie Inu and some of the exciting announcements that were made today regarding Friday, January 21st, 2022. Now, remember, I always like to preface by saying that I am not a financial advisor, but rather, I always try to put you guys on the plays that I'm in. And you guys know Zenu is one of my favorite assets in the market. So let's go ahead and dive into Zombie Inu's price action, the catalysts that are coming in the very short term, and why I'm excited about this token. So without further ado, let's go ahead and dive in in one second. A quick shout out to Mumu and the new background. Things are looking a lot better now here in the office. So before I dive into the video, guys, I gotta give a huge shout out to Mumu. And again, get your five free stocks with a link in the description below when you deposit money into your account. If you deposit $100, you get a free stock of AMC waiting for you in the description below. Zenu, what do you guys have for us coming? So you guys see here per Twitter, they stated that Friday, January 21st, count it, January 21st, literally around the corner for us, we're expecting Polygon's bridge to be official. Let's go ahead and zoom in a little bit so you guys can see probably a little bit better. But yes, the zombies are coming to Polygon. Xenu launching this Friday on the Polygon uh, blockchain. Be sure to follow our officials, uh, official channels in our bio for additional information. So they have a little clip, of course, to go with it, like they always do. With the little Xenu there, contract launching Friday the 21st. So if you're somebody that has been awaiting the Polygon bridge before you invested because you're not a fan of Ethereum and you're not a fan of Binance, well, guess what? Xenu is now officially heading over to Polygon as of Friday the 21st. A lot of other really cool things have been showing up. Little sneak peeks for some of the NFTs. And this one here looks pretty dang cool. But let's go ahead and talk about this video here. Regarding the zombie, you know, are you ready for judgment day? They say, and pay attention to this video. I'm gonna make it full screen actually. Let's make myself a little bit smaller so you guys could see exactly what it is that they are showing. Judgment day is coming. Judgment day is coming. They continue to tease us. That right there looks like a Judgment Day NFT. I don't even know what to call it. Terminator, if you will, right? It does look like the Terminator with the gun and the red laser eyes. But again, guys, what Xenu is doing with their NFT collection is going to be big. You guys know that, again, the only individuals that will have access to the Xenu, specifically, again, the Xenu NFT drop that is happening quarter one. We don't know how soon. Could be January, could be February, could be March. But we're anticipating and expecting the Xenu team to drop their NFT collection for Xenu holders who will get first dibs before they go over to OpenSea. Remember, three-dimensional NFT that are coming to the ecosystem for the Zombieverse and Zombie Inu. So again, if you're not excited about Xenu, I'm not really sure what in the crypto market will excite you. Because again, they have three-dimensional NFTs. They're going to have, again, interactive NFTs. Just a lot of fun things. Even the animations really are exciting me. Let's go ahead and dive into the price action a little bit and kind of discuss. Because again, I don't believe the price action is doing what I'm anticipating or expecting Xenu to do. And to be honest, the overall market has been sliding. And so this is a time when you have to make the decision for yourself what to buy, what to sell, and what to hold. For me... I continue to hold my Xenu tokens because, again, I do believe in the long-term vision that they have. So with that being said, whenever I have dry powder or money set aside for tokens that I really like, that's when I decide to buy the dip. And you guys can see Xenu rallied, followed by a significant decline in price or a decline in price from January 17th all the way to December 18th. Pretty much a full 30 days nearly of just drops, a couple peaks and drops here and there. But again, all the way to 630 Satoshis, we'll call that. Recovered quite nicely, again, leading up to January 2nd, followed by another downtrend. So we know where we have some support. Strong support right around 6, 000, the 6,100 level mark, and currently we're at 9,000. Can we continue to decline if the overall market pulls back? Yes. Is Xenu a token that I am worried about for a long-term hold? Absolutely not. Sitting at a $52 million valuation right now, I do believe that Xenu token is still extremely young. And I say it time and time again. I've said it on their community pages, I've said it on Twitter, and I've said it on previous videos, that Zombie Inu is a token 
that has the potential to become a multi-billion, B as in boy, billion dollar valuation and infrastructure. Always continue to do your research and get excited for the continued work that these developers have been doing. I really love the roadmap. I'm excited for the Zombieverse and what it has in store. And remember, for those of you who are interested in these NFTs, these little teasers and these clips, I encourage you to go over. They've been dropping some hints here and there. I know some people started paying attention to Easter eggs. What could that mean? Easter eggs that have just been showing up in some of the NFT videos. So again, make sure you do your research and be prepared, not surprised for what is to come for Xenu. I appreciate everybody's love and support. Make sure you smash that like button if you haven't already. And also, consider subscribing to the channel. I appreciate you guys so much. So until next time, Zombie Mob, keep investing. Peace.